<coughs> Hi everybody and welcome to the TWF uh, Impact Wrestling. And today on Impact Wrestling we have the new TWF World Heavyweight Champion who's already in the ring. Uh, actually think about it. Actually, and today we have the new TWF World Heavyweight Champion, James Storm, who won the TWF World Heavyweight Championship yesterday at his match against John Cena. Apparently he's going to come down now. <clears throat> now. Sorry for clearing my throat again. I apologize for that. And coming down the aisle, he is the PWF World Heavyweight PWF World Heavyweight Champion. James Storm is now the new TWF World Heavyweight Champion. And first off, I just want to say to everybody back there who opened their mouth and said that James Storm wasn't going to accomplish anything, you know, or the asshole. And I heard people run me down, say that, well, James Storm, you were on, you were a multi, you were, that you were at least considered yourself at least a six, a five time T, uh, NWA World Tag Team Champion with Christopher, with Christopher Daniels and Chris Harris. And then you were only making yourself being a five time TNA World Tag Team Champion with Bobby Roode and Gunner and a one time TNA World Heavyweight Chair, and people were saying that I wasn't going to accomplish anything, you know. People said, James, you act too much like Sheamus and Shawn Michaels and Steve Austin. Well, I proved all those people wrong now, did I? Okay, I'm not all proud to admit that I'm a redneck. And yeah, I do like to drink beer from time to time, nothing wrong with that. Now, apparently, some people were upset with the way I was logged about. We had Commissioner Godzilla, the Executive Director of Wrestling Operations for the General Manager Zena, the Executive Administrator Gabrielle complained about how I won the match against John Cena. And allegedly, they're going to give John Cena his return match. How sad that is. Now, John, you've held the TWF World Heavyweight Championship and the World Heavyweight Championship on several occasions. So I don't see why you should be holding it again. Now, that's all I got to say. And all you people who think that I only got over because of what the National Wrestling Alliance did with me. And the only reason why I got over in Total Non-Step Action Wrestling was because I happened to talk like Sheamus 
fight like Shawn Michaels, super kick like Shawn Michaels, and drink beer like Steve Austin, I say F all you, because I didn't get over because I have to have all those three assholes. But speaking of Seamus, that guy, I'm totally done with his ass too. Now some of you might say, hey, you speak matters by Paulie dangerously, or Paul Heyman, or whatever you want to call him, he called himself. My talents were being squandered. My, yeah, here I am. Eight-time TWF Hardcore Champion. One-time TWF World Tag Team Champion. And now the current TWF World Heavyweight Champion. And I know everybody's going to say about how it's a big honor to win the belt. And they're going to say, well, when they're going to tell stories, they're going to say, well, when Earthquake won the TWF World Heavyweight Championship, it was a fucking band-aid. But Earthquake didn't mind because he went through a three-day tournament. Then they're going to tell stories about how it was a piece of shit bootleg belt that broke at least around 1996. They're going to say how the belt was something when it was this black thing and you couldn't tell what the hell it was. Then they're going to say, well, they're going to say the belt had a lot of prestige. And they're going to say, well, they're going to say the belt meant something when it was retired. Yeah, about two different occasions, of course. Well, the point is, regardless of all the people who held either the TWF World Heavyweight Championship or World Heavyweight Championship, none of them were me. Cowboy James Stop! Well, James Storm apparently already opening his mouth. You know. And he's already claiming that that he doesn't think he should deserve that John uh, John Cena should deserve a return match for the TWF World Heavyweight Championship. I'm still trying to find that theme song. There it is. Okay, first off, Zena said, Congratulations, Cowboy James Storm. You proved a lot of naysayers and detractors wrong. You actually won the big one. Now, as far as you saying that you saying that you're not gonna fight John Cena again, well you're right. Because I talked with John Cena and John Cena agreed that he was going to allow somebody else a chance to win the belt. Somebody else who, just like John Cena, made the impact. Cena says, oh yeah, Gabrielle says, and let's not keep you guessing on who this guy is. Whoa. Yeah, we'll tell you who this, who this person is, Gabrielle says. We were thinking, and we decided to go with the probable, the great one, the people's champion, The Rock. The Rock? Wait a minute. Referee, get in here. We need the referee in here. Wait a minute. Xena <clears throat> has booked 
Zena's book James Storm to put his TWF World Heavyweight Championship on the line against The Rock? That's the person that John Cena said that he would let win the belt? Yeah, that's gotta be some kind of fucking joke. The Rock, come on. The guy had wrestled, had wrestled in years. His last match, he plays the Aries and lost. So, why in the hell should I even consider fighting him? Well, here comes the, well, James Storm thinks it's a joke. Referee, it's gotta be a joke. There ain't no way that the general manager, Zena, or the executive administrator, Gabrielle Gomini, first to rock. My name is Madeline Brown. Promotional <laughs> consideration paid for by the falling. For six years. When I made the choice to come to the United States with my... Help your smile! What the rock is cooking! And then here comes the rock, the people's champion, the great one. In the blue hell are you? You know who I am? I'm James. It doesn't matter who you are. Let the rock tell you something right now. You walk around with that belt. A belt that the ultimate warrior, that Ahmed Johnson, that Steve Austin, that John Cena, Godzilla, and Cena all work their ass off to get the Hulk Vader, the Warlord, Hulk Hogan, Mankind, Sting, The Undertaker, Dennis Rodman, Kobe Keaston, Farouk, Jason Voorhees, he says, Abyss, Kane, Miguel Ken, you held that bell and you ran all of them down? Who do you think you are? Hold it. The Rock is going to take all that beer cans you got, spill all the dog out, beer out, shine them sun bit sideways, shine it up, realize, and shut it up, you candy ass. Because you don't know that the Rock won that belt too. You asshole. Whoa! Wait a minute. The Rock got him. The Rock got him. Wait a minute. He's going to do it. The people's elbow. One, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here is your winner. And the new TWF World Heavyweight Champion, The Rock. The Rock has won the TWF World Heavyweight Championship, folks. The Rock has won the TWF World Heavyweight Championship. And a belt that Daniel Bryan won. Brock Lesnar won. The Rock has won the TWF World Heavyweight Championship for the first, for the second time. Help your smell! What the Rock is cooking! I can't believe it! The Rock has won the TWF World Heavyweight Championship back for the second time! It's been years! It's been since 1999 that he says the Rock held the TWF World Heavyweight Championship. 